Hello there, dear viewers! This is NFTW once again playing through Pokemon X to of Darkness. Last video will be Gorgon and all in all, Master Farich is in fact the evil guy. Oh ho ho! This, this video is. Uh, let's just head this way. I think this is what I gotta do. I am a little fuzzy on this order of operations. I know one of the things I have to do, but there's something else that's equally important. Oh, that was. What's going on? Hi, Neff. How am I shot a puck when I managed to snag? That's amazing, already 40. Oh, ooh. yeah. Wait, can't I save some? No? Oh, that's weird. No, that's because I didn't actually have any in there. D due to the fact that I had purified all the Shadow Pokemon I had captured at that point. Alright, let's fucking... Hold on. Is there any... Oh, ye. Ah, ye. Uh, wait, I forget. Okay, so you are fire ground. Which, ooh. Which means... There we are. There... And that's fine too. Okay, whatever. Now I'm just gonna say this. I'm just gonna say this now. The uh, way to um, heal XD001 to purify them, you actually have to have a uh, a full thing, like a full whatever, um, like all nine of those sets. That's it. You have to fill up all nine sets with them at max tempo. And then when you put in the Shadow Pokemon, you just it just instantly purifies. Alright, Cypher's Grand Master Evil has challenged you to get him on City Dark Isle. It appears that our final is not hard is uh, uh it appears that our final battle against Cypher is headed for the final showdown. It's not hard to imagine things becoming even tougher for you, dear. Benef, I know you will win against the criminals. I believe in you. Pardon me. You've ruined Cypher's secret factory? That means no more Shadow Pokemon will be created from now on. That's brilliant use. news. You've really done it, Neff, but there still remains the job. Snazzed was... Uh, I guess the time has come for me to give you that certain something. No, please. One, I'm not interested, and two, I'm too young. Neff, could you, on your next visit to the lab, could you meet me on the ground floor? There's something that I want to give you. Don't forget. Okay, cool. I, I can do that. There's a reason why I did this, by the way. Uh, I think what I have to do is walk on out, leave, then come back. And then... Yeah, here we are. Hi, Neff. I'm glad to see you back. There's something I want to give you, Neff. Could you come here, please? Haha, <laughs> that start with you? Now, come with me. Okay, one, you just imagine this is a carpet, but no, it is in fact, actually, w walking down that thing, you would have hit your head easily. Alright, yeah, it's whatever, I, I get that, man. The battle against Cypher appears to have entered a decisive phase. I think the situation calls for a special solution. 
Neff, there's something here that I'd like you to use. Go on, open that box and take what's inside. Come on. <gasps> it's a Master Ball! That's a Master Ball. It's the only... It, it's the one Pokemon. <laughs> That's a Master Ball. It's the one Pokeball that is foolproof. It has a 100% capture ratio. You should only use it if you're sure that it is the right thing to do. Keep at it! Also, this place is very much not dusty for um, how, how much it's probably been closed. How long? God damn it, words are difficult. Alright, now... What I think I gotta do... Is either... Do I go to Kitty on 4? Very specific person I gotta talk to. Alright, oh, Oh! Yeah, there it is! See? It's the Robo Kyogre! Just sitting back there going like, hey guys, how's it going? Yo, Neff, big news, real big news. That RoboKai ogre uh, we've been telling you about is finally done. Once Grandpa got down to it and got serious with it, he put together something kind of amazing. Come over here, guy. You have to listen to my grandpa. I... Yeah, you just kind of just kind of walked over, you know. So I followed him instead of just watching him walk. Uh, like Pear said. We finally assemble the Robo Kyogre. It's truly, it's truly a work of marvel. Hmm? What's wrong? Is anything the matter? Well, I'll be. Cypher's headquarters is on Citadel Isle, and you intend to go there? Citadel Isle, huh? Uh, when it's on a place like that, it's no wonder no one's found Cypher's base. Really? People might not have been looking that hard then. Due, due to the fact that it's an island that Pete no one has gotten to, and it's a place called Citadark. It's like if there was a place called Stabby Stabby Murder Town, you'd think, huh, I wonder how it's got its name. Uh, the currents around the isle are swift, and the weather is always storming. The place can't be approached by sea or by air. If that is a lie, it can be approached by air because Verich gets there, agreeable, whatever. Her, that was certainly true before, but now, however. I get it, Grandpa! The Robo Kyogre, right? Precisely, Pear. Our Robo Kyogre will be able to reach the Isle. Alright, we must prepare to launch the Robo Kyogre. Net for an F. Come, Pear! Per? I always say pear, but I don't fucking know. Ah, God. Ah, here you are. Uh, over this way. Look toward the pier. That is the Robokai Yogurt. Doesn't its blue form thrill you? I mean, it looks real nice. Thrill me? Not so much. It's all ready to go. You can leave whenever you're ready. Yeah, I can... I can kind of go there. All right, uh, Mr. Verich has gone away. It's... <clears throat> Let me try that again. Mr. Verich has gone away. It left me with a gaping void where my heart once fluttered. Oh, what am I to live for? There's no purpose to this life without him. Mr. Verich, please, come back. Yeah, okay. A kind of weird lady. Mr. Verge is evil. Also, if you uh, basically get rid of like the first part of his name, his his name is either Mr. Rich or Master Evil. Uh, Ride the Robo Kyogre. Okay, sure. Hmm. Citadark! <laughs> well, 
look at all these cipher robots. Yeah, this is one of the reasons why I did this. Yeah. Hey, you! That thing you're riding on. It's kind of cool. I have a feeling I met you in a port somewhere, but I don't give a hoot about that. I do have a problem when someone shows up here without passage on our boat! Bring it on, bitch. Wait, don't tell me. Are you a Pokemon in the 40s? I feel like they might be. That could potentially become a problem for me. Oh no. No, luckily they were like, hey listen, Gorgon? Gorgon can Gorgon now. Pokemon level 36. You guys weaken it down a little bit. <laughs> hey Crawdon. You still got that dark typing? Yeah, you still got that dark typing. Bitch. Ah, that always works out beautifully for me. I, I still love that there is a point in this game where it's like, shit, wait, no, 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 you're tough. I know you're tough. So what I'm going to do is I'm just not going to get into a fight with you and just use sleep powder. Go, sleep powder. No one else thinks to do that. In literally no other Pokemon game do you get anything like that. It's just, ah, I'm this tough guy with all this these resources. No. A Pokemon battle. Oh, no, I lost. Well, guess I better run. It's always how it is. I don't get it. A good mental example of that, a good example of that I can think of, is um, uh, Sword and Shield, where there's Rose who just goes like, Oh man, look at me. It looks like you're going to be fighting me. Oh, I lost. Okay, well. Can't really do anything to stop you now, can I? Oh, god damn it. <sighs> Can I manage? That's the question I gotta ask myself right now. I might be able to. I'll give it a shot. Maybe I can. Oh, oh boy. Oh, that might be a problem. <sighs> Wait, you're dark type, right? Please tell me you're dark type. Oh, for love of God, tell me you're dark type. Oh, nice. You're ghost type, aren't you? Okay. Alright. All that's left for me to do was... Uh, hope this doesn't knock you out. Wait. I got a better idea. This will definitely probably not knock you out. Hopefully. Oh, god damn it. You had to get me down to exactly half, didn't you? Forget him. Okay. It's fine. I've still got this. Oh, please tell me I've got this. Please tell me I don't accidentally use... The Master Ball 2, or else things will get a bit more challenging. 
Oh. And exhale. Yeah, fuck you, Absin. The kid's tough! Yeah, I am. Now go. Be gone. Oh. Darn it. I've got to report this. Ah, alright, well. Can't really get in any Pokemon fights, so I guess I'll just have to make a walk down there. Huh? How do you manage to get on the, this island? You you roll that here? That's awesome! Even Mr. Veritz, the world's richest man, doesn't have one of those. Oh, hey! Hey, it excites the sailing man's heart in me. Listen, how about let, letting me take a ride sometime, huh? You sure, why not? That's right. That's the spirit of the man of the sea. I don't know if this is much of a thanks, but I found this on, in the ship. Thank you. What a nice guy. What a what a generous man. I'm just going to walk over here to make sure. Okay. The elevator door won't open. Um... Am I fighting anyone here? Not right now. Okay, good. <laughs> Actually, no, I, I could just give a pause in there. Right? Right? Yeah, see? Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? I can I, I can end this video here, because if I don't, I'm going to be, no, be here for a little bit. All right, well... <coughs> If you like what you saw, do not forget to like favorites. <laughs> um, next video, we're actually going to begin a an assault. Assault. Siege? No. No, assault would be the better term. On Citadel Kyle. To beat up literally the only people I have left. <laughs> to fight the only people in this region. That I have not yet kicked the ass of. <sighs> but, of course, until then, this is the FTW signing out. <laughs>